One of Tulane's new deans talks health and equities, and a professor examines the history of cool. Those stories and more are part of Tulane News in Review. Tulane professor of history Walter Isaacson appeared on CNBC to talk about NATO alliances amid trade tensions. Tulane political science professor Sally Kenny spoke with Glamour about what Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh could mean for abortion rights. Yahoo shared the story. The Department of History's Jana Lippman wrote an op-ed for the Washington Post about how military bases that once welcomed refugees are now scaring away migrants. Tulane Law School's Layla Halas wrote about the immigration crisis for Slate. And Dr. Charles Zena co-authored an opinion piece about the toxic effects of detention centers on children. It was picked up by dozens of news outlets, including the Houston Chronicle. Tulane co-hosted the International Association for College Admission Counseling Conference this week, and Vice President for Enrollment Management Sadia Dadagupta wrote a viewpoint for Diverse about supporting international students in the age of Trump. New Dean of the School of Public Health and Tropical Medicine Thomas Leviste talked to The Atlantic about black and white health disparities in the U.S. The Atlantic also quoted Tulane oncologist Dr. David Blask about how darkness can impact health. A new study shows doctor burnout is widespread and leads to many medical errors. Assistant Professor of Clinical Medicine Dr. Joshua Denson commented on the research, a story picked up by WebMD, Drugs.com, and more. Dr. Paul Welton told Vox many doctors may not be catching high blood pressure. Consumer Reports quoted Dr. Keith Ferdinand about high blood pressure among the African-American population. In other health news, Dr. Patricia Ferris talked beauty vitamins with MSN. The New York Post asked Dr. Constance Chen about the latest trends in plastic surgery. And Bustle quoted Dr. Nicole Rogers in a story about shampooing less often. Finally, MSNBC aired a docuseries called The Story of Cool, which featured Department of English professor Joel Dennerstein. Stay cool and thanks for watching Tulane News in Review.